Hi, how to use Batch and Print Pro as an NT service for the first time. Now this works with directory monitor, so you can monitor say files in a folder like here and then any changes, any new files that will print and it will do all this in the background as an NT service. Now to set this up, you first go into options menu, directory monitor setup, you set up your monitor to monitor this, for example, this folder here, and set the printer, and then you uh, monitor, set the monitor say every ten seconds. I want it to run. You don't need to activate monitoring for NT service. You click Add to List, so you can add multiple directories if you want to. In this case, I'm going to print all files. You can put in the file type here, say if you just want a PDFs. The file type can be any part of the file name. So you could just put in, say, test, and it will only print the file names with test in them. Click Save and Exit. So you can try that out first by just activating monitoring. In this example, I'm just going to skip straight to NT service. So I'm going to clear the logs from previous because those I've printed before in the past, so I want to make sure the print in the NT service mode. Click NT service, start NT service, start NT service, and, and there it is. It should be now running in the background. You check it's running, you can right mouse on the bottom taskbar and start task manager. Now, in here, you can sort on the image name by just clicking the uh, top column. And then you're looking for BPP NT service, which is a service wrapper, and the uh, batch and print exe. These two are under system because the uh, service has started those two processes as system by default. So you can see that it's installed successfully that way. You can also go into the NT service view NT service log if there's any problems, and in here it'll come up with error if it's not installed properly. So you can see that it's running successfully. This will go into configuration mode only. So if I, um, I need to now check that printer and see what's happening on that printer that I set. So I'm just going to go down Use this one here, see what's printing. Nothing at the moment. So you can see the files coming through here now. So this should be another one after this one called VG. And I go VG. So as you can see, it sent the files under system. You can actually change this by either going to services you can do from here from the menu view services then look for batch and print batch and print pro then in here you can change the log on to your account or another account that has access this also applies to files as well if you're using from a network you might want to use a user login because system might not have access to it and also you can do it from NT service setup setup so that will actually set it if you just click use current user to use yours or you can type in the network path to what you need to use and the password here so I'm going to use local system and then just restart it start service in here as normal and that's it give it a try